First off, I want to say that all baby animals are cute. Um, but the thing about baby snakes is uh, they are the kind where, like, if you thought that hatching or slithering or shedding is cute, then they are really adorable. And a lot of people seem to think so because the online snake trade is booming. And you have no idea how easy it is to get a venomous snake on the interwebs. Although, from the looks of it, only a fraction of the buyers actually register with the state. Well, Texas Park and Wildlife should have records. Of responsible serpent owners, yes. And I'm coming through those as we speak. But that's not what you called me? Now we need you to tell us all you can about the body modification community here in Austin. Basically, anyone who specializes in snake imagery or tongue splitting. Body mod, tattoos, roger that. Wow, there are a ton of shops. But you're looking for something more specific, right? Someone who deals with custom work, different than, say, that army tattoo that Simmons has on his very toned left bicep. Well, how about you, Garcia? Ever going to the needle? Got any tattoos? I don't see why that's relevant to this conversation. So you do? That's interesting. Didn't say that. Even if I did, it wouldn't matter whether it says baby girl or what part of my body it's located on or whatever. And anyway, I have an answer to the question that is pertinent to this case. You gotta talk to this guy, Ryan Cash. He owns a custom shop on Congress Avenue. He specializes in tongue splitting and scarification. Here's his home and his work address. 